All right, so we're back for season number three of Loser Luxury. We're on episode number 72 and also the second episode that we are in a bad sport lobby. And just in case you missed it from last episode, we are going to try to buy the Maze Bank Tower next. And when we buy this thing, we want to put accommodation on it. So in total, it's going to cost us $4,795,000. And currently right now, we're sitting on $2,704,000. So we need to make just a little more than $2 million before we can actually get our hands on the maze bank tower aka the tallest building in gta online so yeah the goal for this episode is to go ahead and make the rest of that two million dollars so yeah we're gonna try to make that two million dollars right now or at least during this episode we'll start out with a kyle perico heist and then i think i'm gonna go ahead and set up and try to do a diamond casino heist i want to do a big con approach but we'll see if that's the one that we're gonna do but before we actually get started with making the money at the end of last episode we were trying to do a sell mission and during that cell mission some guy in a raiju came over and he was playing awful he was a sitting duck in a raiju which is incredibly stupid when you really think about it but he was he was pretty much a sitting duck with the raiju or close to it so i pulled out my homing missile and i patiently waited for the homing missile to lock on to the raiju and the missile just it went it went somewhere else it, it I mean, it, it, it tried to go to the right, but it just didn't go to the right. I got really pissed. There's a reason why the homie missile locks onto things. It's to actually hit it, but um, apparently it doesn't. So I, I'm a little pissed off at that still, even at the beginning of episode number 72. So before we actually get into the money making for this episode, I'm going to go to ammunition and I'm going to upgrade some weapons. So yeah, let's go do that. All right, so here we are. We are at the ammunition. Oh, those are there's a decent amount of people around here, too, so I gotta pay attention to that. But, yeah, we have the helmet missile right here, a.k.a. the thing that just doesn't want to hit the target. So, yeah, we, we got ourselves an RPG. Yeah, I know, pretty much the same thing as the homing missile, except it doesn't lock onto things. But this one falsely locks onto things. So, yeah, I, I don't have to worry about that. I don't have to put my trust in the fact that it attempts to lock onto things. Also, I'm pretty close to the gun van. Uh, I mean, I'll check it out, but I'm pretty sure there's nothing good this week in the gun van, but I, I'll, I'll take a quick look. Okay, I, I got body armor. That's cool. All right, throwables. I don't need this. I, I don't need a marksman pistol. So, you know, I also would really, really like to like upgrade my um, heavy sniper. I'm actually gonna do that. I'm, I'm gonna do that, even though it's gonna be a little bit pointless. Uh oh, I'm gonna die. I didn't die. I'm out. I'm out. I died. I mean, screw it. I'll, I'll make this thing really... Oh, okay. Never mind. I'll make this thing as crazy as I can. I either want the explosive rounds on the pump shotgun or I just don't want it at all. All right. Well, that's pretty much it for creating my heavy sniper and... So yeah, uh, here, let me go outside. We'll recap this. So yeah, to recap, we just turned our heavy sniper into the Mark II version. Maybe a little bit stronger, but nothing too crazy. Oh, I didn't even realize there's people right there. Oh, okay, this guy. Where are you going? I don't know what this guy... Oh, and then anyways, we also got an RPG. So instead of trying to lock on to things with a homing missile, yeah, I'll go ahead and just use the RPG. But anyways, that costs a little money. So now we're sitting at $2,455,000. So yeah, we still need to make just a little over $2 million. So so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do the Cayo Perico heist, try to do it with someone. And then after that, I'm going to do a Diamond Casino heist. And then after that, even if we already have enough money, I'm going to try to close out this episode by trying to sell off my acid lab. Try to get a little bit of redemption after last episode with us failing to sell off the methodology lab. So that should be pretty interesting. Okay, there's a there's a depressor after me. Oh, that's great. That was a different guy too than the person that killed me earlier. Well, yeah, I, I just want to get to my Kasaka so I can start up the Kayabriga Heist, but it's not even happening right now. I can't even make it there. But yeah, just in case if you were wondering, yeah, this is pretty much how a bad sport lobby goes. He's the most toxic players in GTA Online, and GTA Online is already one of the most, if not the most, toxic player base. All right, so we've made it over to Cayo Perico. What is going to be our primary target? Oh, okay, nice. Just running back with a ruby necklace. Honestly, as long as it's not Sinzamito Tequila, I'm okay with that. I'm going to check the rest, see if I can find some more gold. That'd be great. There's only one bundle of gold and a lot of cash. It wasn't even that many, like, paintings either. Well, that's great. Thank you. Thank you, game. Yeah. Dude, I just got a message. I literally, someone, someone just messaged me and he just messaged me saying tacos, question mark. I assume he's referring to Mr. Subscribe for tacos. I am not subscribed for tacos, but 
hey, he makes some fantastic content, though. But, oh, well, maybe, maybe this person mistaken, and he was like, oh, yeah, subscribe for Tom, because he makes that Leisure to Luxury series. All right, I will have to say, usually when I go ahead and, like, purchase a Sparrow and whatnot, I usually neglect, like, buying flares and whatnot. But, I mean, I've been using flares a lot recently, and at least with the Sparrow, I've been using the flares, and it, it, it's been really helpful, I, I will have to say. All right, anyways, I just need to pick up, oh, uh, what is this, the plasma cutter? I need to pick up the plasma cutter. I just need to get out of here, please. Okay, plasma cutter has been equipped. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good now. I mean, man, my Sparrow is on its last leg, but no, 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 no. Okay, okay, these, these flares are getting a little... Interesting, because I, I thought I had that dead to rights. I don't know. These flares are good, but I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I'm a little confused. But anyways, we just get the weapons, and then, yeah, let's go ahead and deliver this. And then after, and then once we deliver this, we'll be ready to go for the finale. All right, there we go. That was the last thing we needed to deliver. So yeah, we're ready to go for the finale. Hey, by the way, I forgot to mention this too. I mentioned this at the end of last episode, but this heist is going to be on hard mode, as you can see in the bottom right-hand corner right here. It says hard mode active. And we're probably going to make, honestly, like the same amount of money as we did uh, the last time. All right, is this guy trying to be like a master negotiator or something like that? Because, I mean, it's just not going to work. You have no leverage to sit on. You have absolutely no leverage. And they left. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, they... I mean, yeah, there, there's so many people that are willing to take 15%. Even if it's in a bad sport lobby, I will find someone that'll take 15%. All right, all right. So pretty much no one's joining right now, unfortunately. So I'm going to have to do this on my own. Okay, where am I? I'm here. Okay, that's that's all right. I mean, it said it was going to like spawn me here, which I mean, I didn't think that was going to be the case, but whatever. We need to go this way. Our swimming is very very good we swim at a pretty good rate because yeah we've already pretty much made it to where we needed to go but yeah i still would much rather have a boat on the way back so that's gonna be interesting try to find a boat okay i don't know exactly where the loot is i mean i know the spawn locations of the loot i just don't know if it's actually here or not okay that guard over there is getting pretty far away uh oh bad well that was embarrassing golly all right yeah we're gonna I'm gonna restart that. Screw it. I'm gonna do a little different strategy. What I'd like to do. I'm gonna take out this guard that I failed to take out last time from right here. There we go. I hit my shot that time. I hear a boat. Oh, there's a boat right there. Come here. Come here. I can't. You're not in auto lock range. Okay, so we're in here. I still don't know exactly like what secondary loot's here and what's not here. I need to check this other location. <laughs> yeah, that, that that loot's lacking. That loot is absolutely lacking. I would like to at least have something i'd like to have something more than cash but i only got two bundles of cash yeah i mean that'll that'll give us at least 100 percent loot bag so that's that's good at least but okay so yeah here's the next bundle of cash yeah not a great loot only one bundle of gold inside the combat there's a ton of bundles of cash though we just got caught again uh, i'm getting pissed dude i'm getting so pissed just mm, do i really want to try to get the elite challenge yeah I, i'm 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 getting the elite challenge all right there we go we got a full loot bag so now we need to go to El Rubio's compound. This is going to be the hardest part of this. Oh, wait. I got to wait for this guy. In, in what world? No, no, no. I, oh my gosh. Come on, man. No, that's it. That's it. Nope, 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 nope. If we're going to do this solo, we're going to be doing this solo right. Yeah, I was just thinking about it. Maybe like regardless, like how I do this heist, you know, depending on if I can get people or maybe I just can't get people, I might as well just get the long fin. Just in case if like, you know, we had a situation where we're having right now where no one really wanted to join. But I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll see how the future episodes go. All right. So we're going to set up a diamond casino heist right now. Yeah, we got to skip out the casino. Oh, wait, no, we got to script out the vault contents. That's what we got to do. Honestly, I'd be down for anything but cash. I need anything but cash. All right, so we made it to the vault. What do we got? What do we got? Is it cash? Please don't be cash. This has been a terrible episode. <laughs> Dude, I'm going to have to do that over again. I don't want cash. cash. If I get artwork, I'm okay with artwork. I, I just do not want cash. Cash is so bad. All right, what are we getting this time? Please, gold. 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 Yes. Got gold. <laughs> let's go all right cool that's all i need thank you very much all right so we got gold that is absolutely huge uh we need to select our approach now you can either do the silent and sneaky or the big con 
I'm doing the big con, even though there's like a, a red skull face on it, but that means it's on hard mode. All right, so now I'm pretty much gonna go ahead and get all this set up. So yeah, I'll see you either if something crazy happens as I'm setting this up or when we're ready to go for the finale. That guy has sent a strike team to attack you. <laughs> this will be interesting. It's only... It's literally only five people in this session. I, we're not in a very populated session, but still people are trying to screw with me. So that's fantastic. <laughs> Let me do a little roll. Okay, I rolled into a death. Nope. Mm. Yeah, that wasn't good. That wasn't That wasn't good. He get, there goes my spare. Yep, yep, this is horrible. Like, why? Why? I don't know. See, this is, this is the part I don't get about some people in bad sport lives. I don't know why. You're trying to like, you know, press me. I think there's a bigger session. I just, for some reason, I can't join. I've been trying to join. I can't join a bigger session where there's a lot more bad sport people. I've been trying. Oh my gosh, how dumb are you? Why would you let other people, why would you let everyone fly your oppressor? Okay. It was fun while it lasted. Do I have an It was fun while it lasted. Holy, how dumb are you? Okay, here's his oppressor. I think right there. Make sure. Yep, there it is. Okay, that's out the picture now. Oh, this is great. He's in a um, he's in a deluxo now. I think. Yeah, he's in a deluxo. That's his this is his next game plan. And he's trying to lose the cops, and he's gonna come after me with a deluxo. I mean, not the best thing in the world. Okay, lost the cops. I need to make it back to my arcade. He, I think he was chilling by my arcade. Oh no no no. Okay, yeah. He's right there. Oh my gosh, how bad are you? Dude, you are concerningly bad. Oh, he's not even coming after me at the moment. Okay. I mean, I can kind of fight with the Tordor. It's going to be very ugly, though. And we still got a half mile to go. I would assume he's going to get back in his oppressor, but hopefully I can beat him to it. I mean, hopefully I can beat him to the arcade. I mean, I'm telling there's only three people. There's literally only three people in this session. I really want to stress that out. Yeah, but there we go. We deliver the fire truck. Oh, nice. Now he said he sent mercenaries here to attack me. Like, I have no idea where this guy is. I haven't seen any sign of him other than the bullets he, he he's not on the map he's not on the map oh i'm back in the big session now <laughs> oh man i'm back with the back with the big crew all right so it's a new day and we're gonna get started on actually completing the Cayo Perico heist and the diamond casino heist and as you remember we did fully set up those two heists and yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and complete those two, and and we're gonna be doing that with a special someone, and that's going to be. I'm in the bad sport lobby. I I, I force Hyper Ninja to get into a bad sport lobby. So here we go, Hyper Ninja times Doctor Crush to do some heist. So this is gonna be great. Yeah, let, let's go ahead, and yeah, we'll actually be able to do. <laughs> we'll actually be able to do this heist. Because I absolutely failed trying to do it solo. I know, that's embarrassing. It, it's very embarrassing to even say out loud, but uh, yeah. All right, here we go. Akaya Perico Ice. What is this, like the fourth one I've done? I mean, <clears throat> first attempt. Uh, that, that's, that's really what happened. You just just ignore the first, what was it, three attempts <laughs> that you saw earlier. Anyways, yeah, we, we got Hyper Ninja in here, though. So we're going to be we're gonna be doing the duo version of the Akaya Perico Ice. And we got right next to the drainage tunnel, so we can just swim a little ways. And Hyper Ninja just informed me this is his first ever Cayo Perico heist. <laughs> Bro. Wow. This is his first Cayo Perico heist. He, I, I do remember now that he mentions it, that he, he made it a point not to do any Cayo Perico heist. And, I mean, he does a lot of Diamond Casino heist, or he did back in the day at least. From what he said, I mean, he, he just plays the game for fun. I mean, he, he, that's all he does. All right, but anyways, we're inside the compound. But yeah, he just informed me too. I'm gonna have to carry him. I mean, it is what it is. I am very used to carrying Hyper Ninja, so that's not the biggest thing in the world. Um, just follow me. I got this. Oh, there is. Okay, I see the one bundle of gold. We're gonna have to get that at some point. But that is a terrible location. I hate that location so much. Is there nothing? Oh crap. Okay, there's nothing down here. Bro, get on the keypad. Sorry, I should have told that. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, there we go. I collected that bundle. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, let's get out of here quickly. 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 Hey, what do you think so far of this Kaya Perico eyes, huh? What do you think? What do you uh, think? I think you're making it a bit stressful. Yeah, if you don't know what you're doing in a two-person Kaya Perico eyes, you're never going to complete it. At least complete it enough to get the Elite Challenge. Hurry up. Okay, there we go. And we've made it out. Haven't alerted a guard at all. Very nice. Yeah, when we did this last episode, someone alerted the guard, like, right at the end. So, yeah, honestly, that went probably as well as it could have gone despite like all the loot we had to get or at least the different types of loot like if we had gold if we just had three bundles of gold it'd be so quick and easy yeah just go ahead just drive into the ocean and just start swimming away from the island oh wait don't go on the road though uh, okay whatever all right hyper ninja that was your first a Perico heist what'd you think i don't know if i like it <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah. But anyways, we get $1.2 million. Hey, I said in anywhere between 13 and 15 minutes. I We pretty much hit that straight on the button. We got 13 minutes and 54 seconds. But yeah, we completed the Elite Challenge. So in total, we made $1,349,000. Not too bad at all. Oh, man. Look at this, Hyper. This is the first time you're getting this cutscene. Yeah. yeah. Popping one back. Popping some spicy water back. Going bottoms up on it. All right. So after that heist, we're now sitting on... 3.7 million dollars pretty much on the dot hyper ninjas in my shot that's fantastic so i'm gonna just turn around or something like that but now it's time for us to get into the diamond casino heist the big con approach so yeah let's get into that all right here we go we are now getting into the big con approach for the diamond casino heist our target is gold that is very nice you know there's no gold or only one bundle of gold on Kaya Perico, and I guess it's because all the gold was here. Um, so yeah, let's just go ahead and steal it anyways. Um, entry disguise is going to be the group EA. Exit is going to be the staff lobby. Exit disguise is going to be the firefighters and the buyers. We're doing high level buyers because we are not cowards. I don't need to get any of this garbage right here. The clean vehicle or the gunman decoy. All right, here we go. The big con approach for the Diamond Casino heist. All right, so here we go. We are in the group EA van. This is going to be how we are conning the people at, at the Diamond Casino. So yeah, let's just head on over to the casino. I, I think we're on our A game right now. I, I'm going to be honest. I think we're on our A game. Don't let Dr. Crush get hot because when Dr. Crush gets hot, he will start hitting um, elite challenges like it's nothing. Yesterday, I mean, you didn't see what I did yesterday, Hyper, but once you watch the video, you will see what happened yesterday. It was pretty bad. But today is a completely different day. I am hot right now. We, I just flawlessly did uh, a Kyle Perico heist. Now we're doing the big con approach. It should be should be pretty easy. Uh, Newsflash, or a, a little spoiler for next episode, Hyper Ninja is going to be a part of that episode too. So you know what that means. We're going to be doing more stuff. Yeah, this is what I wanted to do on the island of Kaya Perico. Just go in, just hold my loot bag on my right hand, and then just start collecting a ton of gold. But I only got one bundle over there, and then I had to collect a bunch of cash. I even had to pull out a knife, too, and, like, cut down a painting. Like, ew. Uh, this one, if you go straight to G... I don't, I don't think know. so. There's 40 seconds on the clock. I'm, I'm going back out. No, I, I'm not risking it. I, 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 I think we, we got to play this safe. We got to play this safe. Well, that's a weird way of playing. You got to get out now. You got to get out now. You got to get out now. Oh, it, we're not making it out. For you, sir, are risky. <laughs> you are risky. 18. I told you. 18. Okay, you got an extra 100K. You got an extra 100K out of that. Bro, now I'm just going to like walk out of here. No, hold on. I'm about to get. I'm about to walk out of here still in street clothes with a with a pile of gold in this bag and no one cares. Initializing. Initializing. Oh, that's the police. Yeah, here's, here's the police. They're like, oh, man, there's a fire in here because Dr. Crush is absolutely on fire today. And I'm like, yeah, I know. Little do they know I am the firefighter. What? Hello, fellow firefighters. There is a fire in there. Or there's a big emergency in there. Go run. 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 Don't. Yeah, okay. One turn towards us. Okay. Anyways, we need to take a look in here. That's good. It's a good parking job. Bro, we're running so slow, but it's because we got gold. It's the one bad thing about gold. We run like a snail. All right, Hyper Ninja, fire up the helicopter. Just deliver the loot to the buyer and... Heck, I think, you, I think we should be getting the Elite Challenge. And there we go. Heist passed. All right, I got 85%, so I got $1,271,000. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, we did get the Elite Challenge. Let's go.
So yeah, in total, we made $1,371,000. Let's go, dude. We pretty much made 2. Point, yeah, pretty much 2.7 million in total off of those two heists right there. That, that was good. That was absolutely good. All right, so we're going to get started, like we said, with the Acid Lab cell mission. But there's a guy coming after us right now. We've been kind of just messing around for a little bit. And Hyper is supposed to be distracting this other guy, which he is failing miserably right now. The guy is in full pursuit after me. I just want to sell off my Acid Lab. I can't start up. I can't start up a cell mission with this guy after me. I just can't. I can't. I'm coming. I'm coming. Oh, I got the kill. I got the kill. I got the kill. I got the kill. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I got run over, but I got the kill. Okay, we need to get out of here. I'm out. Yeah, this is so much more intense. Like, already doing it in a public session is kind of a little bit intense, but this is way more intense. All right, and there we go. We successfully delivered that. And why did you, why did I just get an extra 100,000? Oh, Earn two hundred thousand from selling products. I got an extra one hundred thousand dollars. I was so confused, like why? I mean, I'll take it, but why? But that's why. Okay, that was the weekly challenge for this week, which today is Wednesday, so that ends tonight. So pretty much in total, we made five hundred and five thousand dollars and minus one hundred thousand dollars of that for the actual sell mission itself. Very shocked. Very shocked that we actually completed that. All right, so now we're sitting on five million five hundred and sixty-eight thousand dollars. A lot, a lot of money. And that is enough money for us to buy the Maze Bank Tower, but it is Wednesday. I do know what the event week is for next week. And the event week for next week is going to be a discount on offices and all of the CEO businesses and whatnot. I'm not going to purchase that at the start of next episode. We'll just make money next episode. I'm going to record next episode just straight after I finish the recording for this. So yeah, next episode, we're just going to focus on making money. And then after that following episode, I'll go ahead and purchase the discounted Maze Bank Tower and probably some more CEO businesses. But yeah, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on post notifications so you don't get to miss out on any of season number three of Loser Luxury. Make sure you check out this video right here if you want to see me try to make $1 million in GTA Online without breaking a single law.